Hi guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how to add some sounds, how to add some some emitters, how to add some flares, uh, how to add some rotor, sound, also you can see uh, better movement, so how to do this, how to do these flares and let's start so um, first of all I want to show you how to add some flares um, let's do our Niagara system so you have this uh, this folder this folder um, in the Google Drive, so you need only drag this and drop in content file. Uh, yes, I have uh, my folder in Village and Content, but you need move uh, this folder flare in the content bro in your content folder. Then you need open uh, open Niagara system, open. Uh, sprite render and then uh, you need to uh, find uh, starter content uh, I have it here materials uh, where it is so uh, you need find here smoke uh, material smoke sub UV uh, it's it's here then open this you can see that it looks bad it's isn't very shiny so then you need to duplicate these and open so I need to go back so when you uh, duplicate this material you need to connect particle color here emissive color so when you do this you have this flare you don't need nothing for this tutorial uh, you have it in the content uh, in the Google Drive, uh, you have link and you can download all of uh, that I um, show you now. Uh, it's all of free. Then uh, you need to have some uh, some blur effect from fire. You can see this blur effect on our engines without fire so you can see it's like some blur uh, so how to do the uh, how to do this uh, this emitter so it's very simple too you need to open vehicle uh, in my in my folder uh, transport I move with all of my content here so you need to open your folder it's i think vehicle so and need to download af af18 uh fighter f18c so when you uh, open fx folder you can see some engine uh, engine effects so you need to duplicate default open it i call it a fixed engine and disable these uh, two layers when you do this you have uh, your own blur effect like uh, right here so then you need to add this uh, add these emitters here it's also here so uh, then I want to add some audio also you have it 
uh, in your content. So uh, I have it in transport, but you need to uh, take this, take this folder, open content in your uh, in your uh, <laughs> sorry file explorer find your project open content and village and content and move it here but in in the folder like this you need to uh, put it here uh, with this way so then you move it here you have your own sounds which i use in my project so uh, you have burned after burned explosion gear idle rotor this sound uh tone tone dirty wind also jet and also some uh these things i need to stop it yep uh so these parts work with your sound and um make it like a uh, visible with objects which uh, with some players which stay in this zone so when you uh in the f in the air i uh, go up and uh guys who stay here here this this vehicle so uh it is like meta sound uh, but it's a, it is very simple meta sound it's like it's um make it more realistic it's uh, i i think it's looks great for game uh, it must be in all of games like this so uh here i have helic and also i have another uh another variant of engine of engine particle but you don't need this it's for myself so also i have for left side uh then you have your wheels also you have it you have it uh if you uh have this plugin uh easy fly system easy if i if i the mistake so uh easy fly mode yes uh when you have this uh, this plugin you have also easy ballistic plugin um also you have this easy gears uh if you have it also you can uh, add some some animation of your wheels also so uh for sound of your gears you have it also uh, i put it here also it's connect uh, i uh, take all of blueprint how it's work you can see in your own project so uh, please check the link uh, this sound I show how it's working blueprint now so but I need to show another another uh, sound so intake sound when you see uh, when you hear some uh, some sound of of rotors of rotors inside engine so uh, I have it too I use intake helic for uh, gears I have gear crew uh it must be cool for all all of because uh we need some realistic sound some 
it's like um, um, soup of sounds and if we want to have some uh, not like a one sound or make a lot of these parts uh, we need to uh, use in one queue like mm, I can open this so uh, use a mixer so we have three sounds but in one queue so next I have a rotor also or a rotor sound I uh, you can hear uh, on bigger distance than all of this sound uh, so I put it here on the rotor so that's all about sounds about uh, components so now I want to show how it's work first of all how to add much faster some faster movement without much <laughs> um, I have add some force in my blueprint so add force for mesh then for, for force I am adding a multiply by uh, 1000 and multiply with actor forward here when we move forward he, uh, here we have right right vector but for our uh, for, for our uh, force we need actor forward vector so multiply with this multiply and uh, uh, connect with this pin with force here also with uh, tilt sided when we press A and D uh, but we have right vector here and forward vector here so the same with this part but with some difference then uh, we sounds so when we start engine um, I'm changing some parts our engine starts all of time but when we start engine we hear our our sounds uh, our sounds of rotor so but we need make some some slower sound and then faster so uh, that is why I have uh, I need to open sound of rotor where it is uh, here open this part so when we use this model I have pitch uh, parameter here and here and zero by default and zero by default as well so when we start our engine we don't hear it but when we uh, when our engine uh, become faster we hear some faster sound and uh, and and hear the sound at all so uh, I use these float parameters also with throttle when we uh, go up we hear it more than we st when we stop in air so I, I using these float parameters for sounds also with gears I have this sound play and stop after all 
uh, we sound that I think I'll, that's all but four flares uh, I have spawn actor I'm using flares blueprint also uh, with right with right spawn position with left spawn position world transform but without scale I using this scale default scale so then multiply multicast and flare server also with flare multiply and using kx for this so first of all uh, we need to see how it's work in blueprint also you have it in your uh, link but i want to show it so when we begin play it's very simple after 15 seconds we destroy our actor our flares uh, so then uh, we have even tick with add actor location uh, uh, local rotation sorry uh, and random floating range uh, minus five and five to make it like uh, more realistic it must uh, it's uh, can it paint uh, looks like that uh, if we don't use it but when we use it it uh, looks like that it's more realistic than than this movement so I'm use this part for uh, make it more realistic so we need to add these flares when we have uh, some missiles uh, is uh, triggered on hot uh, on hot parts of our helicopter of our tra of our vehicle so uh, we need to lose these missiles and be alive <laughs> so that is why i'm doing this uh actor and show it how to do this but uh it, it isn't the end so waiting next tutorials thank you guys for watching and see you